Hello, hello, Naima Singletary here with BillionDollarCourage.com. For those of you who subscribe and are in deep community with me, hello, hello to you. And for those of you who are new to my world, this is me just after working out. I have not showered, I have not washed my face, I have brushed my teeth, and I have not put on makeup. And I wanted to do this because I had this idea. It felt very inspired and it felt like it needed to come through sooner than later. And I knew that if I took the time to go work, to go shower and prepare to be here with you in a much more, you know, elaborate way, that the inspiration behind what I wanted to say could sort of pass through because, you know, in inspiring thoughts just you know, they come and then it's almost like a, a breeze and you either catch them and you give them voice or they sort of come and they go. And I wanted to give it voice now. So what I am introducing to the world and people have already come aboard of is my community called Gods in Plain Clothes. And this is a legacy piece for me. This is a community for people who I call weird, crazy, misunderstood, who don't fit in, don't want to fit in, and don't have a community of people who respects, acknowledges, deeply loves, and supports them in their crazy, weird nuttiness. And I had an inspiring thought that I know is absolutely critical for you wanting to birth whatever it is that you were born to birth. Or you were born to birth, that thing. And so I want to tackle it from this angle. If you are active on Facebook, you see a lot of really beautiful quotes from a lot of the greats. You know, one of my beloved mentors is Jim Rohn. I love Ian Levan Zant, Oprah Winfrey, Marie Forleo. Um, I could go on and on. Marion Williamson, Danielle Laporte. I mean, just these fabulous, yummy, juicy priceless gods in plain clothes, who I call. And so for, just to be clear, every human being is a god in plain clothes. They're just uh, vibrating at different levels, different vibrational levels that they're radiating at, and you feel them or you don't. And I see these quotes. I see people posting all these quotes from different people, I mean, you know, just yummy, amazing stuff. But to me, and to the people looking, that is everybody else's perspective. That is everybody else's thought and belief and understanding and wisdom. And when you are a God in plain clothes who is committed to birthing what you were born to birth, your, your peace, your juice, your magic, your wisdom has to have center stage because you were born to birth it. You were born to do this. So the message that I want to leave for you today is what is your voice? This is what you have to, that which comes through you that you sort of have thoughts about and you sort of play with it in the middle of the night in solitude when nobody's around. You have these knowings, you have these nuggets and you have these wisdoms and you're not putting it out there. I mean like quote your name. This is the wisdom. This is the quote, my name. This came from me. <laughs> I didn't need your approval. I just need the God in me. That's whose approval that I need. And so my message to you as a fellow plain clothes God, and I want you to join the community, it is, here's the thing. And I'm going to talk more about this later because we officially launched the uh, Gods and Plain Clothes community April 3rd. And we're doing so many different things, both online and online, to nurture the community to get feedback and information and heartfelt desire from the people who are meant to be in this community so that it really does meet people where they are. And so there's going to be more about this later. But um, it's really important that as a God in plain clothes who is committed to birthing what you were born to birth, that you have a community of people who are recent, who are current with you, who deeply love and support you, who get you, see you. And I don't mean get you, I mean, just like, are like, hell yeah, are rooting for you, are on your side and everything that's ridiculous and illogical and inappropriate and weird and just ridiculous. That's one of my favorite words, just ridiculous about you. And that's what this community is about and providing you the tools and the resources and the support to multiply your business, to multiply your inner being, to be able to be solid in who you be, which is ever changing. And then bringing your gifts out into the world in a way that feels good and congruent and real and right for you.
because it's different for all of us. So I love organizing this, being the vessel for bringing this out into the world for fellow gods and plain clothes. So I'm Naima Singletary. If you wish to stay in the loop with me, go ahead and enter your name and email up above. If you're seeing this on my blog, BillionDollarCourage.com. If you're on YouTube, go ahead and subscribe. If you know that you're a God in plain clothes or you're resonating with what it is that I'm saying and you feel like others need to be in the know, please share this video. That's how we get the word out. This community will be both online and offline. I'm here in the San Francisco Bay Area, but there have been women in France and Canada and other countries and parts of the United States that are like, Hail to the yeah. And this community is to serve everybody worldwide who is feeling deep resonance with the love, support, and resources that will be a part of the God and Plain Clothes community. So I'm Naima Singletary. Please spread the word. Please join the network. Get what you need. What questions do you have? What do you deeply need? What is it that nobody's saying that you feel like needs to be said? What is something that you need help with that you don't see anywhere else? The help, uh, the, the help being offered and provided. Maybe you are the one to provide that, but I want to hear from you. So please leave me a comment. If you want to connect with me personally, you can send me an email to naima at billiondollarcourage.com. That's N-A-I-M-A at billiondollarcourage.com. I love you and I look forward to connecting with you further. Bye-bye.